Hello, welcome back. What was I doing? Ah, yes, of course. Gotcha. I'm on it. Okay, what was the oh, jeez. Oh, Show up oh. Now's a good time to boost. Oh, okay. Pressure him and move it. Yeah. Bang, bang, My move now. This'll hurt. Choose a sharp to get the upper hand. Make it count, Aaron. Get out of here. But that'll work. Dispatching shield. You'll be sorry. <laughs> That this will sting. Initiating skill. You know what to do, Anya. What should I do? Grab the plug. There we go. I know you won't take that. Everyone, take Don't a restoration die. break. Now's a good time to boost. Activating skill. <laughs> take that, you ass. <laughs> Payback time. <clears throat> Amber done. Whew. <laughs> I can live with this. Nice job, Anya. Watch yourself. That one's big. Gotcha. Get that whip. Now watch me whip! Pressure him and move in. There. I'm gonna have to see if I can get her some better water art. Um. Now's a good time to boost. Cypher, activate. Hmm, got that third gate. I feel like that should do more than. Now's a good time activating skill. Uh, Alright, here we go. Almost got it. Use a sharp to get the upper hand. Eat this. <laughs> ah, yeah! I did it! I got more than 75! Activating skill. Have some more. My goal's a hundred, though. <laughs> Dang it. Make it count, activating the skill. Gotcha. Nice. <laughs> I'll take you on. Activating skill. <laughs> Have some more. A chance. Don't you don't do You'll that. Sorry. Yeah. Yeah. Skill. Sucker. Go time. Activate the skill. Got that three hit combo. Mm. I'll take you on. Ah. 
Oh my. I owe you one. I'll take that. Bring it on. Oh man. Not all that CP done is done in my beard. Don't matter none. Yeah. Oh. Alright, here we go. That's how it goes. I'm just getting warmed up. I got level 55. Picture this. Got him. Yes. <laughs> Where are you at? You know what to do on Go time. Keep moving, Ben. Make it count, Darren. <laughs> Sucker. We got the right again. We got the three-piece combo. I, I don't I don't know what I'm talking about. All right, listen. The day just started. <laughs> ah! It's a ghost. Now or never. Uh, hey, how you doing, girl? You know what Did you call her Anya? Am I just not hearing? Oh no, we got No, let's go here, buddy. Get out of here. Now or never. How did you miss? I'll take you on. Activating skill. Have some more. Bang, 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 bang. Nice! Good combo. Excellent. Ooh! Oh, never mind. I thought that was on yes for a minute, because she was the one that leveled up. But that makes sense. Uh, listen here, you stupid stuff. How about that? Uh, how about that? Uh, how about that? Uh, how about that uh? It's go time. Have some more. Now or never. A champion. Too I like doing the. No, we're we're just gonna keep nuking you. Activating 
And she seems so readily available <clears throat> and ready and willing for a beatdown. How about how about we just take care of you first? You'll be sorry. Have some more. Yeah. Yeah. No, 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 no. No, you can you can just bump that off. And not what I meant to do, but it's probably fine. Right, I meant to do the healing one. That's okay. Chances of you actually killing them is pretty low. I don't want to do this, but it kind of is necessary. Got a deal. It's just not as good as Elliot's only song. Elliot, I think, is one of the best healers I've seen. I mean, obviously, in any game, you can spec someone to be the healer. <coughs> you know, with art. But, like, Elliot, just with holy song, is just really good. Anything you can do, I can do better. That looks like a nice chest. I sure it do. Hey! I unlocked the trophy! <laughs> Open the 150 chests. There are even more monster corpses here. <laughs> Who's doing all this? I'm assuming it has to be Elaine. I see slash marks everywhere. Could it be her? That's the only explanation. I wouldn't be surprised. I'm getting worried. <laughs> this looks like a stopping point. <gasps> that hits the spot. Piece of cake. See, I can cook too, you know. It's just going to make it better. Great heavens! There we go. Yeah, look at that! Look at that! Look at that! Look at that! Yeah! 
So close, look at that, look at that. Enemy slain. We're getting up there. All plugins procured. All drivers gains. How to make how do you make them employees of the month? I'm I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I I I just like keeping tabs on that stuff occasionally. Let's get to it. Going to need you to fall back, Elvis. I'll take care of these. What? No! That's too much to handle, even for you. She's incredible. I recognize her. She's one of the killed Tayran Tracers, right? I knew it. Huh? What are you guys doing here? Glad you're all right, Elvis. Gotta hang back. We'll make sure she comes out unscathed. On your students, on your students, and I are gonna back up a lane. The rest of you deal with the other one. She's really going all out. I don't know about the figure those screen tags. I didn't do her justice. Are you sure she needs backup? Maybe not, but she's throwing caution to the wind here, and I don't like it. Not one bit. Galen, we're here to help. I you she completely absorbed in her fight. That's the plan. I don't think we can jump into the fray. You're hopeless, Van. It's a good thing I'm here to babysit you. You'd be a lost cause without me. Shut up, Lainey! And what do you mean by babysit? <laughs> Lainey. I'm older than you! Ah, <sighs> you two are such children. I suppose it's up to me to teach you how to behave. <laughs> Get a grip, lady! Van? Why are you... Is this an off day or something? Your blade works sloppy and you're totally oblivious to your surroundings. Now look over there! My assistants have that one unlocked, so we'll lend you a hand here. Fine, then. You have my support. We'll take it down in no time. Time for a short post. Let's see, what do we got? Keep it up, it's working! Engaging skill. Kaleido. Victor! Use a sharp to get the upper hand. Here goes. Activate your skill. No! Your turn, Judith! I probably am the night. There's nothing I can't swipe. Bring Cat at your service! A chance! On yet! Shine! A coral ray! This is a cool S craft, I will admit. That that's kinda cool. Boost gauge expand. Heck yeah. Nah. Oh. 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 Don't stop now, Elaine! Mm -hmm. Elaine, I'll be quick. A chance! Grab the blood! Innocent field! 
Thanks, Nah, you're gonna get healed. Alright, we saw one. Uh, Energy output maxed out. Your turn, Judith. Initiating skill. Whoa! That was cool. Yeah, look at that. Crimson. Who made sure to work at that one? I guess I'm right. <laughs> <sighs> Listen, I know the incident Crow came as a shock, it did for all of us. But you can't lose your cool like that. At any rate, Brancer's gotta be calm and composed. Even when they're going, it's tough. Who do you think you're... Take some deep breaths. Everything's gonna be all fine. There'll be tough times. There'll be trying times ahead, sure. But we'll get through them. Just gotta take things one step at a time. And that goes for everyone here, not just you and me. I know that. Trying so hard to stay calm. But even still, we. No, I couldn't protect them. I'm supposed to be a beacon of strength for the people, and I failed them. You're only human, girl. If only I didn't let that man escape back in Longboard. No, even before that. If I just had. Wait. Sounds like you're bottling something up. We need someone to lend an ear. I'm here. Are you really? Mm. Then tell me, Van. Why did you leave me? I'm sorry. I don't know what came over me. Ooh, and I want to know! We debuted at both our targets, and we may not have done so without your timely aid. I apologize for how I treated you back there, Elvis. You fought admirably. Wait. I'm going to take my leave now. I still have other work to do. I'll make certain you get compensated for your portion of the work. The loss of Daniel Brad was nothing short of a tragedy. There were times when he beat us to the bunch. But the intelligence proved indispensable on a number of occasions. <clears throat> Same for me, too. Again, try to keep an eye out on that Time Real Time supporter. She's getting dangerously close to the criminal underworld, and she doesn't seem to be taking any warnings. My warnings to heart. Mm. strong as everyone claims. I'm a little worried about her now. I could have compelled her to be so reckless in that fight also. I know it also was after a pause. Well, I guess we <laughs> we know why the Prudential Aids are down here. So what's next? Should we go back to the reporter? I might be prudent. If she's closing in on the criminal underworld, then she could be headed to one place. The so-called Blacklight District, correct? Wait, what did you say about cracking an egg? Oh, there's more than one way to crack an egg. All right, let's do it. That's a wrap. Reward deposited.
Yeah. Oh. Huh? That, that is, is you, you, isn't it, Judith? Judith? Did you dye your hair? Judith, you're still in disguise. No, nope, nothing like that. See, I was just trying out a new wig, that's all. What's up, Nina? Didn't I tell you I won't be back for a while? You did, but Mr. Gotti insisted that I get in touch with you right away. He's pushing the whole film industry to release a statement and make a donation in response to Cray. I see. I'm a little tied up, so I can't do anything right this second, I'm afraid. Can I call you back tonight? Of course. Take care and talk to you later, then. You too. Thanks. That's a big surprise coming from the director. Doesn't feel like him, but maybe he's trying to take action when the stuff hits fame. And he strikes me as not only a passionate man, but a compassionate one as well. Heh, <laughs> for sure. Well, I'm with him. I'm not going to let this tragedy stand. As someone in the film industry or as a thief. <laughs> We're absolutely going to take down Amwata for this. Heck yeah. I can't help but worry about her sometimes. She's a little too single-minded for her own good. Though I suppose that's why she's the genuine article. Unlike me. Hello? Any news to report? I see. So that's where the filming will be taking place. Just as we thought. The only question now is who the final cast will be. You don't have long until the shoot begins, it seems. You're making me awfully suspicious of you. I don't want to be suspicious of you. I like you. I swear I could have imagined... I never would have imagined there was a place like Eve in Heath before coming here. I'm not surprised. Is it just me, or does this district seem even more on edge? Hmm? <laughs> oh, secret agents investigating, yeah, I imagine. I'd assume so. This may be the closest thing to Edith has to a lawless district, but the authorities can't afford to turn a blind eye right now. I guess we should snoop around the shops and see if anyone's... <clears throat> don't think I've seen you before. Will it be? I'll be seeing you. Wait. Oh, hey, what's up? Okay, but we shouldn't when you're here. What you got? Hmm. Oh, oh, I've got some fine wares for sale. <laughs> Best coming. Oh, oh, I've got some fine wares for sale. <laughs> Best come again soon. Thanks. You're welcome. I'll take very good care of it. I can't exactly get around it. What are you doing? Did you hear that? Yeah, I knew it. You were the one who started piling on the questions. Nothing like life comes for you, young lady. Now, we get to enjoy a ride for reward. Come on. Someone needs to go back to Sunday school because that sure doesn't sound like the definition of rightful to me. And just who the heck are you guys? Arkwright Solutions. 
Ah, she really was down here. Are those people Jaegers? I don't think so. Their setup they're wearing looks familiar though. I think their name is Bugbear? Ah, them. Their threat level is a mere C minus. Hey, you looking for a fight, lady? It looks like we're gonna take advantage of the best all modest man to finally get her name out there. Ah, oh, what a bunch of losers though. <laughs> They're called Jaeger dropouts. I'm sure they've still seen enough combat to be a problem though. I only just realized, but they got some real lookers with them too. <clears throat> Guess we'll have some fun showing who's boss. Let's see what you're made of. <laughs> You'll pay for that. Your turn, Judith! Initiating skill. There we go! Go time! I'll crush all of <clears throat> Activating Blink skill. You'll miss it. <laughs> Store for me! Made it Boost gauge limit crushed. Dispatching shield. Go ahead and finish it. Boost gauge limit crushed. But no. Why? You got this on your Wow. Wow, you actually lived. I am honestly surprised. I know you won't take that. <laughs> Don't screw with me. Activating the skin. But why? Now that was pathetic. Who's uh, closer to D or D minus, it would seem. I thought these guys were just a bunch of rookies. Fine, have it your way. Reinforcement's coming in. Doggies? Of course, they have military monsters at their beck and call. Looks like the tables have turned, huh? Figures though, these days caverns full of wusses who are used, so used to beasts they've gotten out of fight. But hey, you ain't we just roll over too. Maybe we should try getting our hired by the new big boys in town. Do you even understand what you're saying? Hey, you yeah, would just roll over, would they? Wait, Ken? What well, just happened? You aren't putting up much of a fight. Perhaps you ought to consider hanging up the Jaeger's uniform if you cannot act the part. Hey, Wei Sheng Shou. I've heard of rumors, but I've never seen them in person. Your strength is supposed to be comparable to hers. You talking about Risha? Don't be scared. We still have the upper hand in numbers. Yes, deploy all so the military that you monsters. don't misunderstand. We are not the main threat you face here. What? How? That is a shame. Your prowess is sorely lacking. Is that the guy who passed on the way to Long Life? The one on the edge of a spike. Oots, Eds. I must apologize. I see I overdid it some. Oh, I did restrain myself. That's a good boy. No trouble caused, no trouble faced. So then, what will the rest of you be doing? Excuse us, sir. We're leaving now! Um, game thought real life for the best visual effects, huh? You sent both man and monster flying through the air. I would expect no less from the famed lion. Your strength only seems to have grown since your active days. 
I no longer go by that name, and I would very much appreciate you forgetting it. Thank you for leading me here, Elder. Not at all. That wasn't the only reason I came here. And I'm sure, with circumstances as they are, that I am going to be relying on you significantly in the days to come. I see. It's good to see you all again. I hadn't expected we would meet so soon upon my arrival. I can't believe two old codgers rolled up and hogged out the limelight. What are you even doing here? Our course of action has been decided, you see. Hey, you as response to currently unfolding events. Your preparations are complete, then? Indeed. The mists have cleared, and we have exactly the number of pieces that we require. Until the matter has been fully resolved, we will also be assuming control of the Blacklight District. That is in accordance with our agreement with this nation's supreme authority. Whoa. And the president signed off on this? What do you mean by the missive cleared? <laughs> it's time you decided your next move. Though I would suggest you listen to what my friend here has to say before doing so. Farewell for now, Aaron. I will be in touch. Hey! I didn't think he'd come all this way in person. Fans, the font's still probably in Longport, but now I really want to know what pieces you mentioned. Are you alright, Yep. Man? This is him, alright. This is how he's always been. He looks normal on the surface, yet everything he does is batshit crazy. Like wandering off with some stupid, dangerous object back when he was younger. <laughs> that certainly brings back memories. Yet, I have discarded my past now, and I would ask that you discard it as well. My old Greenhorn student, Van. This is Van's former master? The one he said was like a father to him? Um, but wasn't he... I've got more to say than there are stars in the sky. But let me start with this! Why are you still alive when you supposedly died three years ago? Master Barkhorn! I am Bear God Zeman, though I was once known by another name. I see you have brought quite a number of fledglings under your wing, Van. Very interesting. Very interesting indeed. Not as interesting as the dead man who's come back from the grave. I'm not sure how you managed that. That is a very long story. Another time, perhaps. Hard to believe it's already been five years. Even harder to believe you're the same troublemaker I once knew. And that those same words of wisdom would come from your mouth, no less. I see you are living in accordance with your own principles. P please, I didn't do anything. I just echoed the words of a much wiser man. Is my man being bashful? Never thought I'd see the day. It's certainly a rare sight. It's rather cute, to be honest. Oh, shove it. Well, you did do a good job of putting Mary Ell at ease. Yes, I think you helped her regain some of her old spirit. I'm so sorry for all the trouble I caused you. I'm such an idiot. I just got tunnel vision and let myself get all carried away. Ingo always warned me about this. But look at me. I haven't learned a thing. Well, I ain't gonna tell you not to push the envelope. That's in a reporter's job description. Just make sure you don't forget what Dingo said. Think about what you can do, and what you want to do. You'll find a clue on how to move forward in the gap between the two. Mm. 
He used to tell me that a lot back when we first met. As long as you don't stop thinking, there's going to be a brutal way to bridge that gap. You just got to find it. We're working on his last request right now. We won't be able to do it alone, but we're planning to make up for all the shortcomings with help from others. Heck, I wouldn't be surprised if that brought us to you before long. We'll need help from more shady, from more than shady folks. We'll keep your head high and let's all do the jobs we're best for. If nothing else, to prove his words right. Right. I don't know how much of a contribution I'll be able to make, but I'll start being more mindful of my cans and wants, and I'll do it while finding a way to move forward. I'm still annoyed that Dango died. Are you kidding me? Those words were quite touching, very befitting of you, and of Mr. Brad. Yes, they, re they resonated deeply with me as well. Thinking about the gap between what I can do and what I want to do is an interesting thought experiment, if nothing else. Can we please move forward from this topic? Yeah, I should let my employees introduce themselves. Anya, yes, you go first. Wow, that's quite a story. Honestly, I had trouble keeping up with it all. So you were among the 12 knights who led the church's girls ritter. Whoa. All right. I've heard a rumor about your ex-force, Roaring Lion. That's a famous name in a lot of circles, so it's not surprising. Yeah! Yeah! Once again, that name is no longer mine. I would ask that you keep that in mind. You saw Gaius back there? Now we know why you passed on the way to Long Line. Why we passed you on the way to Long Line. So you've arranged our invitation there. I'm guessing a few others played a part in that as well. So wait. I want to go back like 15 seconds or whatever to look at that picture again. So that I, I saw Gaius and I looked at Gaius. Namely, Professor Hamilton's hey, hey, a future elder, the Crown Prince of S. Elson, and former president, President Rocky. Bullseye. Like I happen to be acquainted with all of them, including the Grand Prince of Elson and Elder Guillen. The former president was anxious to make your acquaintance, and I believe meeting him would prove to be beneficial for your future. True. Oh, it pains me that a well-intentioned invitation coincided with such a horrific tragedy. It felt like you could have seen that one coming. Even if we hadn't been in Long Live, we wouldn't have been powerless to stop it regardless. And you're the only one who could have foretold that would have been the goddess herself. Anyway, I knew you'd gone off to the Empire after you finished training me five years ago. And I heard you bit the dust during a border dispute in Nord. I said you laid down your life protecting one of your students. Wait, in Nord? Does that is that referring to Gaius? And here you are, alive and well. You cheated death and carried on living. Just without your title and mark. Alright, well, Brian, what you've been doing all these years, you can at least tell me why you never contacted me. Before I answer. I should note that you were not the only one in the dark. I did not reach out to my other students either, and I never intended to do so. I wanted you all to walk your own paths. And I intended to leave my survival a secret, a trump card that I could pull out in the wake of a crisis. Ah. Guessing you figured out it was time to play that card then, to help us with this crisis? Correct. I have news regarding the Mafia Almada, the assassins of the gardens. Oh. Their whereabouts were discovered several hours ago. Oh! What? This would be better if this was all voice. Almada's leader and executives, as well as the gardens' overseers, have established a new base. And it is located in a city within this very country. What's more, that information has been passed around to all the major players in this nation. Wait, all of them? Guess that means the army, the police, the guild are all in the know? 
I assume Hayway and other Jaeger cores are also aware of this yes. new base. I imagine they are all preparing to take action at this very moment. This country's supreme authority is no exception. They have resolved to quell the unfolding chaos. And they will do so by any means necessary, even if that involves fighting one evil with another. Oh, I don't like that. So that's what Guillaume was talking about earlier. I'm sure many Jaeger Corps will be all over this, my people included. Marduke HQ will be likely making their move as well. You can't be serious! All of these groups are going to flood the city at once? So where do you stand in all this, Master? By the sound, I would think they're going to try to capture Almada alive, or go after their heads. So you might be aiming to get their grubby little hands on one of those nuclear devices. That would be really bad. Granted, I don't know how likely that is, just having one of those things would make you public enemy number one. And in a stretch, though, there's plenty of historical precedent for groups using artifacts as weapons. So, given the stakes, what are you planning to do? As it stands, I am effectively dead. If the people of my former home decide to act, I will not join them, nor stand in their way. However, now that the gift of life has been bestowed upon me once more, I intend to honor it by supporting the youths whose futures are so bright. Okay, theory time. I'm suspecting this is a similar situation as to when Crow was alive after being dead because he was connected to Ordeen through magical means. So there's got to be something magical at play here. I don't suspect it to be something. And it may just... I don't remember, because I've seen images of this character before, I think in older games. I'm not 100% sure on that, but I don't remember if he has an eye patch or not. So maybe there's like a hint under his eye patch or something. I have no idea. And also, to keep them safe <coughs> from venomous fiends, like these unwanted guests of yours. Uh-oh. What? Hey, we're busy in here. Afraid you'll have to come back another day. That's so. And after we came all this way to give you a job. And a little souvenir from your reporter friend. Fine, get in here. Let it reel you in. Thanks, bud. <laughs> <laughs> this dynamic inch is so good. <laughs> I recognize you too. Hit the shady duo from the nightclub and thought that. I also met you back in long line. You recognized me after all? <laughs> nice to finally meet you all, ladies and gentlemen of Arkride Solutions. Oh, now there's a face I never thought I'd see again. Oh, neither did I. Tell me, what's a dead man doing out of his coffin? Now, was granted life one more, I don't need to tell you the reason why, because you already know. No need to give us the death glare, you old fossil. We've traded many friendly blows in the past, haven't we? Why don't we bury the hatchet? Let's be like the Jaegers. Embrace yesterday's foe as today's friend. I'm afraid I'll have to decline. <coughs> Had the Azure Abyss or the late Steel Maiden made the suggestion, I would have entertained the thoughts. The Azure Abyss? Who the heck is the Azure Abyss? That's a new one. The Steel Maiden, I know. Wait. Vita? Is that who that is? That makes that would make sense. I think that's her name. Azure Abyss. <gasps> Telling you, world building! Not for you, though, never in a million years. <laughs> He's 
got your number, dear. No one will ever reconcile with you. And for that, you've no one to blame but yourself. I don't know who this man is. You're on thin ice. But your words are laced with the truth, venomous though they are. Yeah, I get it now. You're the guy that the dire wolf and Rind warned us about. You're part of Ouroboros then? Ah. I mean, that makes sense. I, I kind of assumed he was either with, well, he had to be one of three, the gardens. I was thinking he was from the gardens, but that makes sense, especially if other dude is dropping Azure Abyss and Steel Maiden, those are members of Ouroboros. And one of the most highest ranking members at that. Harwood, the, the name's Elroy leader. Harwood. I'm the fourth oh, Anguis. Ah, gotcha. But you can just call me the Oathbreaker. Everyone does. I am Enforcer number three, Lucrezia Isoli. Okay, so still not as strong as McBurn, though. I'm delighted to make your acquaintance. Ah, great solution. So I wonder what McBurn is up to. Hey, put that away. This is smoke free really building. Now. Very well. I promise I won't smoke in here. Ooh. Accidentally went and made an oath there, and I can't afford to keep those. I've got a reputation and a title to uphold, you see. Gotta break an oath or two from time to time. From time to time? <laughs> you break oaths and rules as easily as you breathe. <laughs> true, true. Anyway, on to business. I want you to go on a little trip for me. And what if I say no? Are you for real? You what? You're not up for it? Strange. I thought I heard you took work from anyone. Yeah, if the work's reasonable, and if I like you. And your liking abilities go off and smoke faster than the tobacco in that cigar. I know you guys are... I know you guys are after Armada. Probably you know where they're at, too. But before we ask you what that is, I need to know why you've come to You us. gotta be kidding me. Do I really gotta spell it out? It's cause you kids will make things way more fun. Huh? Fun? How can you even say that? There's something fun about this whole ordeal. Don't waste your energy on this guy. He isn't someone you can appeal to with logic or The society has already decided its course of action for this whole thing. And I'm leading the charge. Enforcer number three will be backing me up. And so will Enforcer number eight, who you already know so well. The goal is to round up the members of Almada and the Gardens and murder every last one of them. I see. And you ain't doing so in the name of justice, I'm guessing. Nope. Had they kept to their little dog and pony shows, we wouldn't lay a finger on them. Honestly, I rather enjoyed kicking back and watching them wreak havoc. But they've become a threat to our plans now, and we can't have that. If those little bugs want to punch above their weight, then we'll crush them beneath our feet. <laughs> Though no doubt it will be easier said than done. They're both troublesome and insidious, and some rather formidable guests will be joining their party. Hey, you will have some fierce competition. Everyone's got different aims here. Some want them brought to justice. Some want them dead and buried. Heiyue will surely be joining the fray. And I'll bet the Jaeger Corps will be after their bounty. I'm guessing Marduk HQ will be there too, yeah? More than likely. The guild won't stand by either. Same goes for the Garals Ritter. Artifacts are involved in all this, after all. I wouldn't be surprised if other forces from the church showed up as well. All right. 
You got students in other parts of the church, not just the Grawlsritter. Things are gonna get interesting then. Must be tough being a master. <laughs> I don't envy you. If this is what Fate has in stone, then I will allow it. Has in store. Regardless, that should serve as the basic overview of the situation. Almada and the Gardens will not be the only sources of mischief in that city. One wrong move and the whole affair could turn into an indiscriminate bloodbath. So someone ought to keep an eye on the little guys, don't you think? In other words, civilians might get killed and you aren't gonna look after them. You guys are scum. So if Almada really does have nuclear weapon in their possession, we have no choice but to get involved. You can use whatever justification you want. I don't really care why you join, just so long as you do. Of course. Because if you don't, this whole thing will be a snooze cruise from start to finish. I need you kiddos to prevent this battle from being too one-sided. What the heck do you mean by that? The guild's the only one in this brawl that's going to be fighting for the common man. If we add you to the mix, however, it'll make for a more balanced blend. A recipe that's made for chaos. Oh, go choke on your cigarette. Oh, and should you happen to run into us, I'd like you to come at me knives out. And ready to cut me into a million little pieces. I'm very much into that sort of thing. Of course you are, because you're already not a madman, but a freak. You're one of those masochistic... You've got a reason for chasing Almada down, so I'm not opposed to doing this on the side. But first, I need to get one thing straight. I have a bunch of you guys... I have a hunch you guys have some connection to either Almada or the Gardens. Just spill it, what kind of relationship does War Boys have? Huh. Well, it isn't a close one, if that's what you're wondering. We haven't exactly been keeping in touch as of late. But your hunch is on point. We do have a connection with the Gardens. Of course you do. That doesn't surprise you me. You see, the two of us were once part of the Order of the Moonlight Wars, an organization of assassins. Okay. Fourteen years ago, Ouroboros destroyed the Order, but they extended a hand to the two of us and brought us into the fold. Although they did not do the same for many of its other members. The society is a small group of elites, and they only accept the best and brightest. Fortune had not abandoned them, however. Shortly after, another villainous group was nearly wiped out in a major operation. My companion here herded the lost sheep of both groups and let them form their own flock. Wait, you don't mean... Huh. Has it already been 14 years? So you're the creator of the gardens. <laughs> Time sure flies when you're having fun. And the society has offered me a wealth of entertainment. We're going to end this here because it's almost time for the recording to end. And I will see you guys next time on Trails.